Meet Ellie the elephant, who discovers she can play her trunk like a trumpet. Follow her exciting journey from the jungle to fame as she learns the power of dreams and hard work. Each part of the story is packed with fun and important lessons for little ones. Once upon a time, deep in the jungle, lived a young elephant named Ellie. Ellie loved to explore and discover new things. One sunny morning, while splashing water with her trunk, she accidentally made a funny noise. She tried it again and heard the same noise, like a trumpet. Excited, Ellie kept playing and the noises turned into beautiful sounds. Her friends, Jumbo the hippo and Nara the monkey, came to listen. Ellie, you sound amazing, said Nara. You should play for everyone, Jumbo added. Ellie felt a warm, happy feeling in her heart. She practiced every day, dreaming of sharing her music with the whole jungle. Little did she know, this was just the beginning of her musical journey. Ellie practiced her trunk music every day. She got better and better at making lovely sounds. One day, Nara the monkey had an idea. Ellie, let's put on a show for the jungle. Everyone will love your music, Nara said, swinging from a tree. Ellie felt a bit nervous but excited too. Jumbo the hippo helped by spreading the word. There's going to be a special concert, he told everyone he met. That evening, the jungle was buzzing with animals, eager to hear Ellie's music. They gathered around a big clearing, waiting for the show to start. Ellie looked at her friends, took a deep breath, and began to play her trunk like a trumpet. The music was magical, and everyone cheered. Ellie was so happy, and she knew this was the start of something wonderful. Ellie loved making music for her friends. One day, a big bird named Melody flew into the jungle. Melody had bright, colorful feathers and loved music too. She heard Ellie play and was amazed. Ellie, you are really talented, Melody said with a big smile. You should come to the big city and play for even more animals. Ellie felt both happy and scared. The big city sounds fun, but also a little scary, she said softly. Jumbo and Nara promised to go with her. We will be right by your side, Ellie, they said. So Ellie agreed to go on this new adventure. With her friends by her side, Ellie felt ready for the big city and all the exciting things that awaited her and her music. Ellie, Jumbo, and Nara traveled to the big city. It was huge and full of lights and sounds. Ellie felt a bit nervous, but Jumbo and Nara cheered her on. Melody the bird took them to a big theater. This is where you will play, Melody said. Ellie saw many animals waiting to hear her. She started to play, but her trunk made a funny noise. She tried again, but the funny noise happened again. Ellie felt sad and scared. Don't give up, Ellie, Jumbo and Nara said. Ellie took a deep breath and tried one more time. This time, the music came out just right. The crowd clapped and cheered. Ellie smiled and felt proud. She had shown everyone her special talent and it felt wonderful. Ellie's concert was a big hit. The animals in the big city loved her music. They wanted to hear more, so Ellie played again and again. She even started to teach other animals how to make music with different things. Ellie felt so happy and proud. She realized that even if something is scary, trying your best can lead to wonderful things. Jumbo, Nara, and Melody were so proud of her too. Ellie became famous for her trunk music, but she never forgot her friends who helped her along the way. She returned to the jungle to share her music with everyone there too. Ellie's heart was full of joy and music. She knew she could do anything with her wonderful friends by her side. And so, Ellie the Elephant's musical journey continued, bringing happiness wherever she played. The end. We hope you enjoyed this story. If you liked this video, please go ahead and push the like button. If you like the content and want to see more, please subscribe to our channel. Goodbye.